How are we looking? Okay. Swag. And you stop saying swag. I don't know when I started saying it or why I started I say saying it, it but I say it all the time. Right? It's not 2018 anymore. Everybody. <laughs> Can you hit the, the button? The shutter button. What button is that? It's the circle button by the it's handle the, with the grip. The button that, that you would take expect. a picture with. This one. The button the, that you would button. expect to the be. The one right that's button. on like the little, like the woo. Button. You know, like that. <laughs> No. <laughs> when you click it. Because you were saying like this. Bothering my hands with lotion. So, it cut off some of you. I don't know. But, I believe you. So, this is the Film Club, or Student Film Association, actually. But everyone calls it the Film Club. I don't know why, but they do. So, my name is Lindsay Gotti, and I am the president of the Student Film Association. I'm Brendan Lee. I am the financial advisor. I am Jonathan Martinez, and I'm the vice president of the SFA. <laughs> SFA? <laughs> The SFA. <laughs> well, we like to watch a lot of movies and make a lot of movies. It's kind of the do some watching, life. some making, <laughs> some W's and M's. You know, we make we make stuff. Yeah, yeah. We, we do all things we, uh, we do stuff. film related. Yeah, all things film related. You got a film? We'll do it. <laughs> Anything at all? <laughs> yeah, right there. That's where we're going. <laughs> that's gonna be it. That's gonna be it right there. And that's how we're starting this documentary. <laughs> I'm Devin Alisa, I'm the president of the Performing Arts Club. I'm Kevin Casey, I'm a member of the Performing Arts Club. I'm Matthew Cesari, and I am a member of the Performing Arts Club. Well, our meetings are pretty, uh, they're pretty freeform. We sort of just have ideas, ideas. we all come with ideas, and um, we throw them out, see what works, what everyone would be interested in, and then um, we kind of just uh, spitball from there and see if we could get into contact with other clubs to collaborate and stuff like that. That's uh, most of. That's mostly how our meetings go. They're pretty. Yeah. They're not by the books or anything like that. It, they're. You just show up. We talk for a bit. We discuss everything. We sort of just. So and sweet. Yeah. Yep. Pretty much it. We've had people from other majors uh, interested in joining the club and have come to come to a couple of meetings. However. Um, most of the people that really participate in the club are typically music majors, music performance, um, musical theater, music tech. Those are the real, the main majors that really um, have done stuff in the club. We've done karaoke and the uh, town show. And, uh, and, and trivia night. Exactly. Last week we did karaoke and trivia night. Uh, we also helped out with uh, the ASA Mochi night and we, uh, our member Manny. He does pretty much the sound for every uh, every club event ever, so mm -hmm. we're we're pretty involved um, in the in the school and their events. Um, we're about community and uh, the power of friendship. Uh, my name is Ethan Sonneson. I'm the president of Fashion Club. I'm Eli Cortezano, the vice president of the Fashion Club. We have the studio open for fashion students, so it's a nice place for people to come and get work done um, because schedules are so busy. Uh, we have people from other majors too. Um, majority of our uh, club is fashion majors, but um, we don't shy away from accepting anybody from any major um, if they want to, if they're interested in learning things. We have events uh, fa that are fashion related sometimes, um, and people from all different majors come and participate. We have an end of the year fashion show. It's um, not specifically for the club. Uh, it's for the um, the major as well. Like the whole program does a fashion show, um, but fashion club will be there for that. So my name is Andrew Amoyo. I'm the president of the Black Student Union here at CCM. So um, some of the goals and objectives we do in the Black Student Union are to create a safe space for um, Black students, promote Black culture here at CCM, and to empower um, African-American students to um, be confident in themselves with their education and taking on leadership roles and being able to um, see their goals and um, attain it and achieve whatever they want to with the education yeah, that they will receive at CCM. This past year we did a lot, you know, before I was just a member, um, we had the potluck dinner, we had open mic, there was um, so many, you had a Halloween night where people dressed up, there were so many events that were going on the past year and you know, we've we been going really strong this year and I'm really proud of um, what, what we've done so far and 
our last event, one of our last events upcoming is the Diversity Fair on Tuesday. That'll be um, a good a good show out for us. You'll be able to see um, a lot of you know what makes us special as a club. And we're also planning an ice cream social for people just to come and hang out, have a cool treat, to, you know, enjoy the uh, end of the semester in May. So look out for that. That'll be uh, April 18th on the Diversity Fair, and then the ice cream social will be um, at a later date. Hello, I'm Gwen. I'm co-president of the Student Nurses Association. Oh, sorry. I'm Lisa. Um, I'm Lisa Ray Buzak. I'm co-president as well of the Student Nurses Association. Still a little confused if it's student nurses or student nurse. You know what works. I'm trying to figure it out. <laughs> well, we try to plan a fundraiser at least once every semester. We try to do something um, including the school. So like we're doing diversity day. Um, we have to do presentations for that. Um, a lot of educational stuff too. Yes. So we'll get involved in like hand hygiene. We'll like do like little things about that, educate the students about that, or maybe we might work with other clubs too to talk about maybe education about vaping for example or mm -hmm. other topics like that. Coming so, this fall. Coming this fall. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be definitely at the diversity um, festival. We are going to be doing a presentation related to healthcare disparities as well to tie into um, diversity. We are also going to be at um, the picnic. There's going to be a spring picnic coming up. We'll be there as well. And we're also going to have a, a Celebrate Nursing event day. Yes. It's like uh, it's beyond just Student Nurses Association. It's also involving the faculty, and we're going to have guest speakers. We're going to have a lot of people coming in. The entire student it's center is May going to be decked 9th. out. Yeah, it's going to be decked out. Yeah. So we're going to be there, and we're going to have fundraising there as well. And we'll be giving out little goodies and pins. Yeah, stickers, and pins, things like related. that. It's going to be a big event, yes. I did want to mention we also have a partnership now. I talked to Jessica from um, Interfaith Food Pantry. So we are in partnership with them. Yeah. Uh, last semester we did a fundraiser for them, and this semester we're doing a fundraiser at the picnic and also May 9th. So. Overall, majority it is nursing and pre-nursing students, mm -hmm. but we do at, like, what is it called? The bash? Welcome bash. Yes. We do open it up to people who are outside of the major. So, like, in our first meeting, we definitely had some bio majors come in who were generally interested. One respiratory therapist. One respiratory yeah. therapist, yeah. So we do have people from other majors come in, yeah. but it is mostly nursing majors who are usually active in the pro in the club but we do welcome everyone one thing I did want to mention um, is some people don't think like oh I'm in the nursing program like I can't be a part of this club if you're mm -hmm. still taking the prerequisites like anatomy physiology micro you can still pe be a part of our club and um, if you're not a major yeah. you can and you're in just interested in mm -hmm. just being in a club related to nursing we take you too yes. so we're open to everyone but we tend to see more nursing majors obviously in the club uh, thank you guys of I course it. of course I'm Elliot Park and I'm the president of Writers Club. So Writers Club is basically a student collection of um, different students interested in writing. Um, we take students from all different kind of disciplines. You don't have to be an English or creative writing major to join. Um, writing can be your job or it can be your hobby. Um, so we kind of get together, we write, we appreciate writing, um, we do different events related to writing, sometimes competitions, sometimes open mics, um, and we offer a collaborative and supportive environment for people interested in writing. Last semester we did a Halloween party as well as a Halloween writing contest. Um, we did a um, Friendsgiving event where we watched a movie and had pizza. We did an open mic in December. Um, this semester we have um, done a planetarium show to kind of spark ideas for science fiction. We are hosting the open mic during the diversity festival. We have a book event kind of coming up with Dr. Chase from the English department. Um, we also have a movie night with LGBTQ plus club. Um, I think, I think that's about it. <laughs> a lot of stuff, I know. It's like, you guys got a busy schedule going yes, on. Yes, busy schedule for sure. I would highly recommend joining if you're interested at all in writing. We have posters around campus with our email, which is just writersclub at, uh, at student.ccm.edu. 
We have an Instagram page um, that's relatively active. Um, we have club meetings twice a week, so um, you're very welcome to join. Um, yeah, Writers Club is a great club and I look forward to you, um, our upcoming events. All right, that's yeah, awesome. Thank you for your time. Yeah, thank you, I appreciate that. When you said happy birthday, I was like, is his birthday today? I know that's what I I'm just going to start off with your names and then the positions in the club. What is my position? <laughs> You're, just, you're our assistant, you. Yeah. You're an officer. I'm an officer. Yeah. <laughs> happening it's right literally now. not even recording. Oh, right now it, it is. is. <laughs> my name is Stacy. I am the president of Photo Club. My name is G. I'm the vice president of Photo Club. Hi, I'm Kate, and I am an officer in the Photo Club. Kate's the assistant. No. <laughs> we like we to take photos in Photo Club. Um, <laughs> we the goal is to just anyone who's interested in photography. We want to help them improve their skill, give them a community to work in, um, and a place to get feedback from. And we like working with other clubs and helping out other clubs while also, you know, working on our craft. I wanted to comment. <laughs> Hi, Michael. <laughs> One event that we have done, this is the second year now that we've done it, is the headshot event where any students or faculty from CCM can come get a professional headshot done by us for only $5. And it's a really great opportunity for students to get professional headshots done at a price that they literally will not find anywhere else while also letting photo club <laughs> while also letting photo club members work on studio photography and get more comfortable in a studio setting i almost threw up yeah so we do photo shares and photo walks they're much more casual than our other events it's just whoever wants to come can the photo shares are held in the photo room dh210 and we basically just anyone can upload photos and we go through them and we look at them mm -hmm. and people can talk about what they are proud of with their photos ask for any help or like get any opinions on like changes that might be made um and then the photo walks are just an opportunity for photo club members to work together and get you know outside opinions and advice we go usually to parks and we'll walk around for a little while take photos together take photos both of each other and like of the landscape again anyone who wants to is available to come you don't need to have a camera um people bring their phones you can if you're a photo <coughs> club member you can also borrow a camera here from the photo department so mm -hmm. that's probably one of our most fun events because it's very um it's really laid bad. back we like to go on field trips we also have worked with other clubs. We Last semester we did the music festival. We collaborated with the Social Awareness Club and the Black Student Union. And we did a photo booth there and we also did concert photos for the artists. We worked with SGA on the Halloween Bash last year and did a photo booth there for students. Um, that's pretty much it. Okay, yeah, great. Yeah. Party. So thank you. Oh, I'm mm -hmm. so sorry.